Meantime, the president will on Sunday depart Abuja for the United States to attend the 78th United Nations General Assembly, which will take place from September the 18th to 26th in New York City. On the sidelines of the United Nations General Assembly 2023, the president will be having investment at the front and center of his conversations with his counterparts around the world in order to continue advancing very aggressively on his economic development and diplomatic drive to attract foreign direct investment into the country as he did at the just concluded G20 summit in India. President or briefing State House correspondent, the Special Advisor on Media and Publicity, Ajuri Ingelali, said President Tinubu will actively participate in two major summits at the UN aside from the general debate at the Assembly. Sunday, His Excellency President Bola Ahmed Tinubu uh, will be departing Abuja uh, for New York to attend the United Nations General Assembly of 2023. Uh, of course, uh, aside from the engagements he's going to be having uh, at the General Assembly, uh, aside from the active participation uh, that uh, the Nigerian delegation uh, will be uh, engaging in at the Assembly, there are a series of very important side activities that will have wide-ranging ramifications on the Nigerian economy. Uh, the President, uh, again, uh, focusing in on his uh, economic development diplomacy, uh, will be uh, having uh, investment at the front and center of his conversations uh, with his counterparts uh, around the world. Uh, and these engagements include bilateral meetings on the sidelines uh, with the President of the United States, uh, with the President of Comoros, with the President of uh, South Africa, with the President of the European Union Commission, uh, with the uh, Prime Minister of the Netherlands, uh, with the uh, King of Jordan, uh, with the uh, Algerian President, uh, with the Brazilian President, and with the Spanish Prime Minister. The President would also meet with major chief executives and leaders of multinational firms cutting across multiple sectors of the economy as part of a series of very important side activities that will have wide-ranging ramifications in the Nigerian economy look to expand their operations uh, beyond the shores of Nigeria, and that is what that summit uh, is intending to do. Uh, in addition to that, the President will be uh, speaking at uh, the UN high-level reform of the global financial architecture. Uh, this is a sequel uh, to the engagement Mr. President had in Paris. Uh, it will essentially allow uh, our President to lay out his vision uh, for a fairer uh, international uh, financial system uh, that does not uh, any longer uh, leave out uh, developing countries uh, from the decision-making table. Uh, he's very determined to drive this. Uh, he's leading it from the front, uh, and that's a very important engagement uh, on his schedule. The President would also be presiding over the Nigeria Small and Medium Scale Business Summit to ensure that Nigeria keys in on opportunities that have been presented by the Nigerian-owned small and medium-skilled enterprises to make an impact in foreign markets. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.